Happy birthday, my baby girl! <laughs> Happy birthday! Hi everyone, so I'm about to give Ava her birthday presents from me. I didn't wrap them uh, because I've had a really bad week, so I haven't really had any spare time where I've been okay enough to do anything. But today's not about me. It's Ava's first birthday and I'm really excited. I'll do a haul later, maybe in a separate video. And what she got from her birthday party yesterday, but go watch that vlog and give it a thumbs up. I don't know. Are you wanting to open your presents? They're in this bag. Sorry about the um, little bit of mess. I haven't vacuumed yet. I was supposed to, but whatever. Go through here, see what's in here. What's in there? It's Ava's birthday presents from Mummy. She just likes the bag. Okay, so we got some Minnie Mouse outfit. Much too cold to wear this today. Comes with a bib and it's got some shorts. And to go with that, I got you some Minnie Mouse shoes. Focus. Okay, whatever. I really didn't get her anything very interesting because I knew everyone else was going to spoil her. So there's not much in here. Look, Ava. Um, James was supposed to be buying her a ball pit, but he hasn't done that yet. Um, I'm not sure if he will, but that's also why I didn't buy too much because a ball pit is pretty awesome. Look, this is for you too. You like that one, don't you? <laughs> Got her a couple of books. My mommy loves me. An ABC, because we need to learn our ABCs and all the animals. I'm really excited to read that one with her. Why is there a camera? I mean, a candle in here. And then there's just some more clothes in here. This is a sleep suit. She's got some shirts. She already has this shirt, and I didn't realize, but I had already bought it. <laughs> and I was going to save this for summer, for Christmas, but I wanted to wear it as soon as it starts getting warm. It's so cute. And a Lonsdale shirt. So that's everything that she got from me. Like I said, James is supposed to be buying her a ball pit. It probably won't happen until like, later on in the week. But even if it happens later, she's still going to get a ball pit, I hope. He is at work this morning. And we were going to wait till later to do presents. But I don't think he's going to be in the mood. So I just did it now. And it wasn't that exciting anyway. Do you want me to open that one for you? Let me open it for you, Ava. Here, we open it. How do you open this? No, you're not having the camera. This does say for three plus years, but I saw it in the shop and let her have it, and she was loving it. So I said, you know what? I'm just gonna get it for her. I don't understand why it's three plus years. Maybe because children don't actually understand it until then, but she's gonna have fun playing with the balls. Is that fun? <laughs> <laughs> Give me that. I'm gonna try and make us some breakfast. Um, it's a little bit of a mess in here because of the party yesterday. There's food everywhere, bits and pieces everywhere. Oh my god, yuck. Our fridge is also broken, it doesn't close properly, and not really sure why. Mm. Today, the plan is at 10 o'clock this morning, I have a doctor's appointment. To get the three month depot shot, the injection, um, to stop me from getting pregnant. And yesterday I mentioned that to my mum because she asked what I was doing today. And she said that I might as well just get Ava's 12 month injections while I'm there. And I had completely forgotten that they get more injections, so I was like, yep, sounds good. So we're gonna head off there this morning. Hopefully my doctor doesn't take too long. He's very well known for being behind because he loves to talk to his patients. So I'm going to the doctors and then whenever that finishes, I've left the time frame open because I'm not entirely sure if it's going to take longer because he's always behind or if I'm going to be out on time. But either way, I do have to walk all the way back here. And my nan wants to take me out 
with Ava to buy her something for her birthday because she hasn't bought her a present. She didn't want to buy something that everyone else had. And she does this a lot as she'll either give us the money to buy them something or get us to buy something and then she'll pay us back for it. Something like that. But we're going out shopping today. I've got some money from one of her aunties. Or she's my auntie as well. She's her great auntie. And I'm going to try and find something to buy with that money as well. Mm. Ava's actually really loving this pram with her babies in it. She's got two babies. She has a third one, but she's in the bath. And she's going to stay in the bath, isn't she, Ava? But she's loving her babies and pushing them in the pram. She's a young mum already. <laughs> hey, what are you doing? Got the pram? There's stuff in your way, isn't there? Mummy, move it. Yeah. Off you go. Off you go. Good girl. No, you know you're not allowed to have it. I'm going to try really hard to just enjoy our day today. I've been having a really terrible week um, and it's been rubbing off on her. But because it's her day today, I don't want to let my emotions or my own misery get in the way of her day. So we're going to try and enjoy it. Chloe might be coming over later. Whenever I'm free, I need to let her know. But because the day is going to be so unpredictable, I told her I'll just let her know when I'm not doing anything. She's going to come over and give Ava her present that she bought her. I want to try and make something really yummy for dinner because we haven't been cooking all week pretty much. I've just been in not a good headspace and I've been really busy working a lot. Trying to clean up and prepare for the party. <laughs> come here. Good morning everyone. Okay, Ava's going to crack it because she wants the camera. No, would you like a cupcake? We're still trying to finish off party food and I'm feeling like a good mum today so she's going to have the cupcakes for breakfast. Ow, my hair, honey. So I thought I would show you everything that Ava got for her birthday. There's a lot and I think I'm missing some of it but I'm just going to show you what's around me right now so I can get it out of the lounge room really quickly. <laughs> Our friend Hannah got Ava this sloth. It like clips up so she thought she could wrap it around herself which is awesome. She loves it. Do you want the sloth? You got the sloth? <laughs> <clears throat> Our friend Michaela got her this unicorn and something else. She also got her this dress which is in a size 2 so it should last a while. Um, I don't know if it'll fit her now. Oh, it's like a onesie dress built-in thing. I want to try it on her, but I don't think it's going to fit yet. But thank you, Michaela. From my sister, she got this dress. So it's her auntie. She got this dress. It's a Disney dress. It's so pretty. It's like Bambi and yeah. And it's like a onesie dress again. It has the things in there. She got her a pair of shoes, which she's already worn. And I think she's left them in the kitchen. But she really likes those. And I really like them as well. Because now that she's walking, I'm trying to get her into having more pairs of shoes. These are the shoes that my sister got her. This is only one of the shoes. But it's just like plain pink. They're really easy to get on her feet. But they're also really easy to get off as well. From our other friend, Michaela, Ava got an animals book. It's called A Parade of Animals. And I'm actually really loving that book because Ava is trying to learn about animals. I don't know where it is at the moment. I thought it was in her nappy bag right here, but it's apparently not. But I really like it. So thank you so much for Michaela as well. Our friend, Peter Marie, got Ava lots of clothes. Where did I put them? Um, she brought Ava this jacket, which she's already destroyed because we wore it the other day. Um, it's nice and woolly inside. I really like it. It looks so cute on her. It's like little butterflies and stuff. And then she just got her like a bunch of sets that come with a singlet, like a long sleeve singlet. And then a shirt or a long sleeve shirt, like a onesie. This one's just pink and spotty. It's really hard to tell. And some of them are like short sleeve singlets. She also got her some socks. These clothes all came from her as well. So there's a few more singlets, a couple of t-shirts. That's so cute. And then just a few pairs of pants. So thank you to Peter Marie. From our friend Tanya, one of my mummy friends. I mean, most of the friends that I've said already are mum friends. She got us this trite or three-wheeler, whatever word you want to use. Um, and I really like it. Ava doesn't know how to use it yet, but I'm really excited about this because we can go sit out the front or outside or something and she can just play with it. Except James hasn't put the wheels on properly yet. 
I'm not sure what he said he needed to do, but he's going to try and fix that later. She also got us this book. It says Ava counts from 1 to 20. And I'm pretty sure she got them made up because she said she got some for everyone. Like from our mum's group, she said she got a few of them for people. So I'm thinking that she got it made up herself because inside it says lots of love from her daughter's name. And then her daughter is a character in the book as well. So I thought this was amazing. I was like, that's so cool. The website on the back here, is, I'm assuming that's where she made the book from. So if you want to make a book, go check that out. You can't go up there. <laughs> from one of the other girls in our mum group, Grace, she got her this t-shirt. And I love purple on Ava, so I thought it was really cute. And she also got her... Um, it's like a snail toy and you push the top of the snail down and it makes lots of noise. She really likes it. I'm not actually sure where I've put it at the moment. But Ava really likes it, so thank you, Grace, as well. And all of your little cherubs. The next few things, I don't really remember who they came from. Um, I'm really sorry. But Ava got this puzzle. And this microphone. I, I don't know if it came from my sister or if it came from someone else. But thank you to whoever bought it. Here's the snail I was talking about. We haven't really had a lot of time to sit down and play with all of Ava's toys yet. We went out yesterday for lunch with my nan. And I didn't take my camera, so that's why... How do you turn this off? I don't know how this thing turns off. I want it off. Yeah, I forgot to take my camera out, but we went shopping with my nan after we had lunch. She shouted us lunch, and it was amazing. It tasted so good. I love going to that place for lunch. And then afterwards, we went. Afterwards, we went, after we would, <laughs> afterwards we went to the shop, and my nan told me to pick some things out that I wanted for Ava because she didn't want to buy anything that anyone else already had. So I got to pick it out, and I said she didn't need any more toys. So I got some clothes that are going to be used in summer because it's almost springtime, which means it's going to start warming up. I got her this gorgeous pair of shorts. Oh, they're just so freaking cute. And then to go with it, I got this yellow shirt. And I've been loving yellow lately. I don't know why. Not really on me, but just the color yellow is amazing. And they go together because the yellow at the bottom and then the yellow spots. Kind of hard to tell, but yeah, I got those. I got her a pair of bathers. I just love this colour. It's showing up more blue, but it's sort of like a greeny blue, a mint blue. I mean, mint green. And then with this purple shirt. I just thought it was cute. It makes me excited for summer. I can't wait to go swimming more in summer. I never took her swimming really last summer because she was so little, but now I really want to. I think the last thing that we got was this dress. Oh, it's back front. This little dress. I'm really excited for her to wear this as well because she doesn't wear a lot of dresses or anything. Um, yeah, but we're going to start branching out. Oh, before I forget to mention it, James's parents sent down a present from... They don't live in town, so they sent down a present. And they got her a light-changing money box, and it's really pretty. I've already started putting money in it. James's sister actually got her... Um, a money box that said Ava's first saver and now that she has her second saver I'm not putting any more money in the first one I'm gonna be as like this was the first thing that she was saving money and now that she's got a second one I don't know if that makes any sense but I'm putting money in the next one now it's like a unicorn and it's metallic it's really cute now we can start with what my parents got her Someone else also got Ava this doll I forgot about it it's been sitting in her prayer my mum got her this doll um, and she brought like bottles and dummies and stuff and the bottle when you put it in the baby's mouth it makes noises and Ava's really interested in trying to feed babies so it's really cool <clears throat> and my mum also got her this pram it's kind of hard to tell but she got her this pram and Ava loves it she put everything in there last night I found some chips in there found my sunglasses in there she just loves putting things in there so she's really enjoying that <clears throat> My mum also got her one of those dogs that sing and play, like it has things to play with all on their ears and buttons to press and stuff. But that's at my nan's house at the moment. Oh, here's the other stuff. This is the bottle and like, that must be juice. And the potty for the baby. 
You wanna go feed the baby? You got really bad snot, oh my god. My parents also got Ava this show bag from the show that comes around every year. Um, it's the Hungry Caterpillar. There wasn't very much to choose from other than like Peppa Pig or I don't know, other children things, but honestly there wasn't a lot. They're all kind of the same thing. So I just got the Hungry Caterpillar because she has a Hungry Caterpillar book. I think I put everything in this bag. She got a placemat. She got a book to read in the bath. It's not the actual Hungry Caterpillar book. It's just like, what color is the apple, you know? There's this cup thingy. Daddy. Very Hungry Caterpillar. Comes with a hat. This is my favorite thing, but she's not going to um. to use it. And there's a bib. I think this is a bib. Baby milestone cards and then a cutlery set. I think this is actually for like little kids. And my parents also got her this. It's like a TV remote. I think they thought it was a phone, but I'm pretty sure it's a TV remote. I don't think it's on. How do you turn it on? Okay, well, I'm gonna go and clean up all of this stuff and that's gonna be the end of the vlog. I know I didn't really vlog much, so that's why I included the haul in this video because I ruined Ava's birthday by not vlogging. Like, I ruined it for you guys. You didn't get to see anything we did. Honestly, it was kind of a chilled out day and we really didn't do much. Go check out Ava's birthday party video because that's more exciting than this one. Um, please give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it and we will see you next time.